Hello YouTube, Robert Alvarez the Psychic Witch, also known as Mr. Lighting and a Fan. There's plenty of lighting, but there's no fan. No, I stand correct, there are fans above me, okay. So Mr. Lighting and a Fan is in the right place at the right time. So, today is Saturday, October 26th, 2019. The sun is currently in Scorpio, and the moon is waning in, no, 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 it is waning, it is waning in Taurus because tomorrow is a new moon, which means that today is a dark moon. Um, I think I've mentioned in previous videos how much I love dark moon tides, the three nights before the new moon. They're perfect for banishing, surrendering, and releasing. And because it is a waning moon, or rather a dark moon in Taurus, it is an excellent time to surrender and release any attachments to poverty consciousness, to creative expression, to creative flow, and of course to divine romance all of the Taurus energy auspices. So I am here at Chill Wine Bar, and I am very happy to be one of between 12 to 15 readers giving readings today at the second of the two annual Notions and Potions Psychic Fairs at Chill Wine Bar. Um, I'm actually not setting up just yet, but I wanted to show you some of my sacred tools in my medicine bag. So this is something that I found in a thrift store. It's a Lancome. Um, makeup bag, but if you look, it has a little jewel things, and um, it has this lining that has like different jewels on the inside, and I keep my crystals in here. No, that's not my crystals. Um, I keep my crystals in here. So I have a, a gem bag for my gems. You like how I did that, right? <laughs> and then of course, I have some of the decks that I'm using today. I'm definitely using the mythical goddess tarot created by the late Sage Holloway and illustrated by the current and great Catherine Skaggs. I also have the dark goddess tarot, which I recently found out is back in print, created by Ellen Lorenzi Prince. And by the way, I am going to happily show off one of the incredibly beautiful Sparks Creations uh, tarot bags. Um, I've been a fan of, of Peggy, of Sparks Creations. Peggy is the wife of the wonderful wife of Lisa from um, Supportive Tarot. Yes, Supportive Tarot. And then, of course, I have my Nipis. Haven't used the Nipis in a long time. I'm so much more connected to the Afro-Cuban part of me, but I keep forgetting that by virtue of being Cuban, there's a Spaniard part of me. So here I have, and there's a crystal that came, oh, it's a rose quartz. I loved, by the way, I love tarot bags where I can put crystals in them. And this one has an amethyst and it has a citrine quartz. So all quartz family crystals are in here. And, and this is one of the beautiful bags that Carmen made for me. Um, <clears throat> so I have my Nipes, which I love. And they're also a really good deck uh, for people who have small hands, especially if you want to use like a divination deck or an oracle card deck. I'm not going to show everything, but I'm going to show a few things. Um, and then, of course, I have been waiting for this psychic fair to use the Weird Cat Tarot by Gabrielle Cash. And I'm very excited about it because, oh, and this is another Sparks Creations bag. And I know that I've done this before in previous videos, but look at this bag. This is the guidebook that goes to the deck. Notice a, a trend. And this is the deck, the box in the deck. The deck in the box. I got it right, the deck in the box. This was not planned. Like, really, this was not planned. I actually purchased this before I even realized, before I even knew about the Weird Cat Tarot's existence. And when they all came together, I was like, oh, that really works. So yeah, so that's, that's the cool thing about that. So I'm gonna keep this video short and sweet, you two, because in a little while, Anne-Marie, who is Cheryl's right-hand goddess, some of you don't know who the hell I'm talking about, Anne-Marie is the right-hand goddess of Cheryl. Cheryl is the living goddess who owns Notions and Potions, who has just walked back into Chill Wine Bar, which is perfect. I talk about a goddess and a goddess shows up. That's what's called a witch bitch cackle. <laughs> That's mine, I'm still perfecting it. So YouTube, there will be another video later today. Um, I'm hoping to do another video like I did last year um, at my favorite Whovian Paradise, the Pandora Restaurant. But for now, I wish you a beautiful day full of love and light, prosperity, money, and magic. And thank you, and good day.